Hey there friends and welcome back to Strange Rebel Gaming. I'm Brianna White and today we're going to be playing through some more God of War. It's going so well. Right now we're working our way through some side quests because we're only like four gameplay hours away maybe from the very very end of God of War because we want to get to God of War Ragnarok. It's going to be a fun time so I hope you enjoy these videos. Stick around and enjoy. Take a second to like them before we begin, and we'll get on to them. And we're just making our way across this rickety old piece of wood. Just like we always have. See, Kratos and Atreus have this history of climbing across rickety bridges together. They also have a history of just smashing priceless relics, so we're going to continue that tradition as well. Yeah, with our bare fists to get some hack silver out of it. And then we're going to make our way up this thing, because I have no idea where this is leading us. So we're- oh, to a treasure chest! Well, we're not mad about that. You just gotta smash that with your bare fist too, because such is tradition. And then, whoa, whoa, I did not expect that at all. I thought we were jumping, and then I thought we were under attack. Ooh, everything's fine. I am fine. Good. Take one of those, smash one of those. Good, 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 good. All good things. Now what haveth we here? Ooh. I don't know if I'm gonna get that far, but I am. Fantastic. Magic. What what what, what are you doing? What were you doing? Why did it look like he was like playing monster or something? I don't know. I don't make the rules here. Okay. Uh, I don't think we want to take that just yet, but I'm sure we're going to want to. Okay. So oh, that's the screaming ring. Right, 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 right. But I know, I know. Don't trust the talking ring. Oh, well that getting out of the way made a ladder. Fantastic. Not what I thought was going to happen, but fantastic nonetheless. Because then we get to go all the way up. Oh, no. oh I did think we were about to get attacked. What if I just crushed you? Did you, were you prepared for that? You clearly were not. Clearly we're not prepared for this eventuality, and well, you should have been. Oh, I don't want to be in one of those. Hey, come back! Hey, don't run away from me, that's kind of rude. Oh, I just knocked you right off, didn't I? Get up, get back here. That one. That one. Focus on that one. There we go. Now we can focus on that. There we go. Thank you, Atreus, for being ever so helpful. Kind of. Right? I mean, I don't know if it was harder than usual. What do we have here? An epic talisman? My first? Create a small defensive zone that prevents Kratos' attacks from being interrupted and reduces the amount of damage he takes. When upgraded, it restores a small amount of health as well. I do like that. 
I'd like to upgrade it for sure. Right now we have defense eight, vitality 10, small burst to health. We could have small burst to health plus the small defensive zone. I do like it actually a lot. So I think upgrading that is gonna be tippity top priority. Um, but no Atreus, I don't think that was that difficult. Boy. Father, please just listen. Invari's crew did something bad here. He's glad you destroyed his life. And he's sorry he kept trying to trick us. His hammer is just through this gate. Is there also some big evil bad behind the gate too? Because I've just used all of my Spartan rage. Mm, and I have some concerns. So we're gonna make our way through this gate. I'm guessing with Atreus' help to get Antvari's hammer. No problem. We got this. Certainly there's nothing scary on the other side of this. Boy. Sir. And certainly this won't glitch anything like last time. Okay. That's going in the journal. What's going in the journal? Removing an ancient soul and domesticating it as a beast of burden was surprisingly easy. They followed my every command and appeared to possess no free will. Removing an ancient soul? Why can't I do that? Then I don't have to fight it. A lack of their own must be what drives them to immolate the souls of others. My soul eaters are an abomination. Several were sent to Muspelheim at the request of Surturer. What he will use them for, I shudder to consider. Another to Mjotskinir at Kjonsgard. That fool can burn for all I care. My immediate concern is the dwarves of the Vulander Mines. I pray I'm not too late to undo my mistake. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, I read that whole thing out loud and I took in none of it. I don't know what that said because I was way too focused on how ridiculous these names are. Anyways, that's very good information for people who are lore heads. Meanwhile, this looks like something I should break. But I won't. I could, but I won't. But I will heal up. And I will take what's ever in this giant glowy golden chest. Let's see what's inside. Take! This is a fine hammer. Oh, it's the hammer. Fantastic. Mavari says thank you. You're welcome. Now, I wonder if this is what's going to crash into those rocks. Let's try it. Push. Can we keep him? The ring? No, Ooh, you can't keep the one. ring. <laughs> Everything's fine. I'll just punch him to death. Actually, I mean, my statement was pretty accurate. I did punch him to death. What can I say? I'm right all the time. So who, who's surprised? No one. All right. So it seems our work here is done and we shall make our way out. And we talk to Brock. See what Brock has to say about all that. You can find that hammer or yes. you're too busy looting every keyhole and cranny. Yes and yes, actually. Here, the alchemist hammer. His spirit is a nuisance. Yeah, Anvari always was an asshole. Hell of an alchemist, though. Hand him over here and I'll melt him down. What? You're going to melt down your friend? A trapped soul's what I need to give your reward some extra oomph. You don't want it? Father, we can't do that. Here, you hold on to him. He's really useful, I promise. <sighs> Fine. So long as he proves his worth. What? No, I want the reward. I don't Kid's need- a bit of a softie, huh? 
Well, he'll grow out of it. I don't need the talking soul. Very high perk activation chance to grant a health burst on any successful runic attack kill. I know you say that's epic, but I kind of am not feeling the epicness of it. That's not my fault. I just feel like maybe I'm more of the type to use all my run runic attacks early on and not as finishing blows. So I feel like, I don't know, anyways. Okay, so we've completed that side quest. That's fantastic. Let's move on to the only, well, okay. So there, there's like side quests and then there's like side quests. So let's continue on with the main two dwarven side quests that we have. So this is Fafnir's Horde is what we're going to be doing at this point. So Sindri told us about the dwarf Fafnir, who was renowned for his collection of stolen treasures. A treasure-filled storeroom sounds like it might be worth a look. Sindri asked us to keep an eye out for a special whetstone from Niflheim. I just hope nobody got there before us. That sounds like ominous foreshadowing. To Fafnir's Horde! Wherever that may be. Get out of here, seagull! Oh my gosh, I saw the funniest, the funniest video the other day of a girl just trying to eat a snack what looks like on a pier or a wharf or something and as she's eating it in slow motion the seagull just attacks it right out of her mouth and then there's a sign in the background that says watch out for the seagulls attacking oh <sighs> sometimes life is just that funny sometimes it is you know where why do i feel like i'm trapped how do i get out of here get me out of here uh, oh, there is a little path here. Okay, perfect. Come here. Why did you say Tyr felt responsible for what Odin did to the giants? There was an incident shortly after the forging of Mjolnir, when Tyr arranged a diplomatic meeting between Odin and the giant kings. Well, this was when the Long War was young, when victory was still a thing dreamed of, and the Jotnar might have tipped the balance between Aesir and Vanir. Odin had persuaded Tyr that the hammer was merely a deterrent, a means to broker peace from a position of strength. Tyr was hopeful to convince all parties they would prosper best through peace. He knew the giants were deeply concerned about the hammer, a super weapon in hands they did not trust, but they trusted Tyr. Tyr always believed the best in people, and taking Odin at his word and his desire for peace, he brought the Raven King to Jotunheim. From there, things unraveled quickly. The giants anticipated Odin's trickery and exposed his true agenda to spy and steal their secret wisdom. With magics, they expelled Odin from their realm and cursed him never to return. Frustrated, Odin visited his fury upon the giants of Midgard. Thor unleashed Mjolnir's might upon any giant he could find. None could stand against the tide of slaughter that followed. And at last, it seems, with Tyr's aid, they retreated. The tower disappeared, no giants could be found in Midgard, and no man nor god has set foot in Jotunheim since. Uh, that story is very depressing. Kind of a bummer, you know? But we're just gonna go ahead and smash barrels until we make our way to Fafnir's Ravine. Look at, look at the, the, the structure of these amazing, like crystalline rock. Love it. It feels so otherworldly, doesn't it? Wrong. We have crystalline rock structures like this on earth, on our earth. That's not a fantasy geologic structure. That's real. Isn't that crazy? Every time you think you've seen it all, you haven't. We can beach over here. 
Malware from Fafnir's ravine to Fafnir's storeroom. This Fafnir sure owns a lot, doesn't he? Up we go. I thought we left Atreus behind, if I'm being honest. <laughs> Do I hear the sound? I hear a sound. Do I hear the sound? Yes. There sure is a lot to see here. Where is the bird? Where is the bird that I hear? I hear it! <laughs> Where is it? Better not be in this pot. <laughs> ah, there you are. Goodbye. All right, nailed it. We're making great progress on the 51 ravens. <sighs> 51 of them. It's too many. Smash those boxes just in case. Definitely. You can't. You can't smash the bird. Treasures I mean the all fish. Do you think fine. that Fafnir went to Alfheim too? I do not know. Aren't you curious? He sounds interesting. We go to the storeroom to collect anything useful for our journey. Not to learn more about the dwarf. Fafnir was a rather interesting fellow, little brother. Perhaps I'll tell you a story one day. You do like to tell stories, Mimir. That much is true. However, Atreus is really more of the curious one. At this point, you'd think Atreus would maybe have learned that, that maybe you should be curious, and that's not a bad thing, but also, like, don't expect Kratos to be curious with you, you know, things like that. But sometimes kids, they have to learn a lesson 8,000 times before it sticks. I mean, 8,000 is like an approximate number. Sometimes it's only 7,000. Sometimes it's 12,000. Have you made it out of Fafnir's storeroom yet? What? I... I just got here. I didn't think we'd see you out here since you and Brock got back together. Everything okay? Impatient. Oh, better than ever. You know, I really think we've both grown in our years apart. So how come you're back here? Just catching some fresh air. Look, I love my brother, but he still smells like a fetid dung pile. Probably is pretty awful, honestly. You know, I it's interesting. I I know we got these side quests before Brock and Sindri became pals again. I'm curious what the dialogue is like if you do these quests before they come back to get together as brothers. Because it's fascinating to me how game developers have to think about that kind of thing. How they have to create kind of like an A dialogue and a B dialogue based on where you're at in the story. I think that shows a level of dedication to the craft and to immersion that I think is just really cool. Doing here. Okay, Atreus, I'm busy. Thank you. Okay, so Aegir's protection. Here's the thing. We don't have any pure essence of realms. So we cannot upgrade this talisman. Yet. I would like to do that, but I don't know how to do that. And because I don't know how to do that, I'm kind of like Oh, that's fine. Always happy just to chat. Hmm. <laughs> really wishing that I could upgrade that talisman. I don't know, you know what? Life's too short to not try out the talisman. Let's try out the talisman and just see what happens. Because obviously this has better stats, but maybe this is just like a super OP defensive zone. I don't know. Reduces damage that he takes. I, I'm not a scientist. I don't know until I try it. So, ah, die. Come back here. That, that was a bad throw, I'll admit it. That one was better. 
All right, we're really making progress on those 51 ravens. Yeah. We just got two in, in one stream. Honestly, nailing it. This is cool. This is kind of a different vibe, huh? Nice and foresty and... Still got things to smash, of course, because why not? It's got some cicada buzzing in the background. That's kind of fun. A nice different environment from the other ones. Oh, froggies! Look at them go! And butterflies! What a cute little forest! Reavers. Uh-oh. They must have gotten here first. Okay, but I heard another crow. Ah, well, you're not so high in the sky, are ya? Three in one stream. Look, we're gonna have 51 in no time. In no time. No time at all. Watch out for the frogs, though. You don't want to crush the frogs. Or do you? Nah, frogs are an important part of the ecosystem. All right, now you are going down. Every last one of you. What? Yeah, I, I honestly. Oh, I hate these little flyy boys. So annoying. Good, good. Ripping more shoulders. Ah, hey, hey, hey! Get away from him. Good, good. I'm gonna take out some of you. Really unfortunate for you that I activated my runic attack. Yeah. What? Come back. Okay, that's not doing anything, so I'm just gonna use that instead. Rip more shoulders off, honestly. Like, why not? I honestly did do a great parry there. It is over. Perfectly timed. Oh, one of these, huh? I see. Well, do a little health. Take a little hack silver. Do a little smashing. Good, good, good. And make sure we thoroughly investigate the area. So that we can find all of the little things that need to be crushed or activated, or whatever this one requires. Let's find out. Oh, oh, okay. Well, I was meaning to vault this, but sure. Okay, take, easy. Good stuff, good stuff, okay. I hear another raven. Are we really gonna be killing that many ravens? Oh man, I should have done this. Had I known. Would have been really fun. Four ravens in the span of like eight minutes. I mean, I am, I am so impressed with us. 51 is gonna just come and go like that. Now, here's the thing. Oh, there you are. CR, where's N? There's something up there. Uh, thank you, Atreus. I had no clue. Now, if I know this game, which uh, I'll admit What's that? is a little bit, not a lot of it, the N is gonna be difficult because the C and the R are easy.
it sort of seems like the C and the R and the N might have... Ah, there you are. Okay. Let's see what happens. Look up there. Atreus? Don't spoil the game for me. Good. One Mississippi, two Mississippi, three Mississippi, five Mississippi. Five Mississippi. Hey, we did it. We needed five Mississippis. And some change. What'd we get? The Horn of Blood Mead! Good. So the Horn of Blood Mead, we now have two of three, which is fantastic. We need one more, which is no problem. I mean, if we find Horns of Blood Meads, just like we find Ravens, then we're set. Atreus, stop spoiling the puzzles. I'll figure it out. I know there's always a treasure behind the waterfall. Into the waterfall we go. Should we have gone into the waterfall or should we have gone not into the waterfall? Because there was another way to go. But does that lead to a dead end? Atreus, follow me. Ooh. You're in there. Oh, it's locked. No. Good. Find Fantastic. Another entrance then we don't need to make a decision after all. That is going to be an easy exit for when we have completed this part of the mission, which is just fantastic. Um, I know what you're all thinking. You're all thinking mission is not a French word and you cannot pronounce it mission. And my response to you would be, But what if it was? Did you think about that? I gotta wait till he comes back around. Okay, Atreus, you try. Well, how come I don't see you shooting these birds? Exactly. Look how many birds we killed. So many, I mean, they're spies. They're not birds. Like, we're not just in this game Whoa. out here killing birds, just to be clear. I just wanted to make that really abundantly clear. Oh, is this our exit door? Suspicious. It's not time for us to exit yet. Oh, well, this is going to be the easiest quest Boy, ever. Boy, here. My journey will be long, and I can only carry the essentials. I leave my possessions under the watchful eyes of the face of stone until I return. Okay. I mean, are these, are these things that we want? We have one rare enchantment, alloy... One re-enchantment, Oblivion Stone, Legendary Enchantment, Glacial Catalyst, One Legendary Enchantment, Unstable Ore, One Rare Enchantment, Unyielding Cinders, Aegir's Gold. I don't know. These things are maybe things that we want, but if I was to go finding these, I would do it off stream. Just saying. Why are there so many doors in here? That's awfully suspicious. What do you want? Hmm. Looks like the Reavers made it inside. As I said, highly suspicious. I have a feeling this is going to take a very long time. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Come over here. I gotta kill you with this. 
Wait, 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 wait. Ah! Ah! Okay, okay, good. Don't move. Don't, don't move. What? Kill the pot! Oh my gosh. Alright, 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 alright. Come over here. Let me, let me just... Come, come. Just, just let me position this prop. Hey, 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 hey. I'm positioning. <laughs> Tactical strategy. Ah! <laughs> no! He got me! No! That's so unfair! I was supposed to kill him with that! Oh, this is just not fair. Come on now. There we go. All right, well, both of us got God, at least. <laughs> oh We're gonna die. Keep your expectations low, boy, and you will never be disappointed. That... That did not go how I wanted that to go. <laughs> um... <laughs> Look! Last time I didn't use the explodables in the environment to take out the enemies, and I regretted it. This time, I did do that, and I regretted it. So, I don't know. I guess I just can't win. Look, at least I didn't die. Did I almost very close die? Yes. But did I die? No. And I think that is the lesson to take away from this. Okay, so we have an entry stone. Why do we have an entry stone is my question. Are we just supposed to open another door? Goodbye! Oh, there's more. Good. Excuse me. So long. They caught you off guard. Did I wasn't they? Expecting them. Exactly. Well, they caught me off guard, if I'm being honest, and I'm you, Kratos, so. I think maybe you should not be so harsh on Atreus, if I'm being honest. <laughs> Anyways, we'll put the stone into the hole, and we'll just see what happens. Let me guess, you're gonna open another door. Oh, color me surprised. That door. Yeah, yeah, that makes sense. Even though it's pointing that way, but it, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. This is all as expected. Fake. Through the door. Yourself, boy. Oh, I thought you were a revenant. You are clearly not a revenant. Oh, don't go in the don't go in the poison. You're just gonna miss. Okay, I don't want to be in the poison. Okay, don't power up while I'm trying to punch you with my Spartan rage. I need this to stop. Okay, that was rude. That was really rude, honestly. Where's my blades? Okay. Don't throw that at me, because I'll die. Dodge again! Oh, wolves! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that checks out. There we go. Use this to our advantage. And then let's use that to our advantage again. There we go. No problem. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Now There's I know. Poison in this one. In the stupid bird statue. 
and useful resources. The main reason we are here, boy. You may be However, thinking to yourself. Many of these chests have been emptied. Probably by the Reavers. I hope they didn't take some of these what's them. You may be thinking to yourself. Lemon squeezy. Lemon is not a French word. And therefore you probably shouldn't be pronouncing it lemon. Well. I pose to you. What if it was? Mm-hmm. What if it was? It's all you gotta know. <laughs> Look, that battle went exactly as well as it needed to. And I didn't die, and that counts for something. I don't have a resurrection stone. I should have bought one. I hope, <laughs> I hope that doesn't come back to haunt me. All right, so we put another stone in the hole, I have a good and about maybe we'll even find the what? Atreus. Remember what I told you about expectations, yeah. boy. Reasonable Keep expectations. I remember. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Still, good feeling. Mm -hmm. I don't know if we're allowed to feel good in this day and age of 2022. I don't know if that's like allowed, honestly. All right, what? Oh, uh, a revenant. Seem to recall. Where are you? Ah! A revenant behind me? There should be a revenant in front of me only. Okay, that was really a truly unintentional parry. Oh, let's definitely do one of these. Okay, the wolf should be attacking this one. What is happening? Why are you attacking the wrong one? Oh, they move so quickly. You watch out, Atreus. Ugh, they're everywhere. Yeah, that worked out. Stop hitting me. Fantastic. Stop laughing. You're dead. So much for my good feeling. We did talk about this, Atreus. In this day and age in 2022, we are not allowed to have good feelings. We have bad feelings, and we have neutral feelings. But feeling good is not having reasonable expectations. <laughs> is this getting too dark? Um, good, 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 good. Um, <clears throat> uh, we have found ourselves another round stone here. So, I wonder... <laughs> what are we gonna do with this stone? I have no idea. It's a complete mystery. Total mystery. Okay, seems like... We got most of the things that are in here. So, on our way to the hole. Don't fight me. You don't want this. You don't want this. Wolfelhost. Yeah. I'm gonna wreck your shoulder off. I did warn you that this was not a fight you wanted to have. And you didn't listen to me. I saw. So I should keep my expectations low. But your anxiety but high. An attack? Yeah. <laughs> it is a delicate balance. <laughs> That's 2022. Expect the worst. Assume nothing. <laughs> and always anticipate an attack. Sure is a lot to remember. It's fine. This year is fine. 
Every year since 2020 has been fine. <laughs> Put the stone in the hole, Kratos. Moving on. Um, to the X, I guess. What shall we find behind this door? Expectations low, anxieties high. Bring it on, we're ready. A wolf, an actual wolf. I See, I don't love this, because I feel like you're our friend. I don't like killing the dogs. I actually very much dislike this enemy. Why do I feel like you came back? Stone. And only one room left. <laughs> I know I shouldn't hope, but you should think we'll find it there. No, <laughs> Kratos is so straight. No, okay. So we took the takes, we unfortunately had to kill the doggies, and all these chests are empty. And we're gonna smash the health stones because why not? And we're gonna take another stone for the hole. I don't know. It doesn't get better the more that I say it. It definitely gets worse. So maybe we just gotta call it something else. All right. What next? See, anxiety's high. What's gonna attack us now? Hmm? Nothing? Okay. It's fine. We did it. On to the final boss, which according to the sign is named Hanix. I don't know why they would choose that for themselves, but Someone somewhere was like, this final room shall be named Phoenix. It's fine. What is in here? We will see oh, more froggies and crows and some gorgeous lilacs. Actually, those aren't lilacs, but they are a gorgeous purple color regardless. Why am I getting like big bad boss vibes from this room? <laughs> Why am I getting, like, Ocarina of Time vibes from this room? Ah, uh, what's in here? Let's find out. <gasps> Wrath of the Frost Ancient, a powerful ice beam that slows all enemies on contact. I like it. I like that. Quite a lot. We might just upgrade that from the get-go. That kind of seems fun to use. Let's just go for that. Let's just go ahead and equip that. I like it. That's good stuff. Okay, cool. Let's 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 figure that out. So you're back to piss on my corpse, you ungrateful little. Uh, who are you two? Um. This is not what I expected. We're looking for a whetstone. Have you seen it? Aye, there was one in this room. My son sharpened his dagger on it right before stabbing me in the back. Well, maybe what? you deserved it. Little bastard thought it was his turn to lead my crew. I was hard on him, sure. Mm, guess I shouldn't be surprised. I did the same thing to my dad when I was his age. <laughs> no, then you, you shouldn't be surprised. Father? Kratos is like, huh? What? Where is he now? Ha! <laughs> he may be a bastard, but he's my bastard. You'll get no help from me, fool. 
He literally Maybe killed you. Will help. Hey! That's mine! Hey! Mm, Come it's not. Boy. We are leaving. Spirits don't get things that are mine. Okay, well that was a rude thing to say, ghost. Don't do that. Well, that was so cool. We are going to ride you into the other ogre. Yeah, definitely messed that guy up big time. And then you die. Yup, sorry. That was too easy for me. And then you are also gonna die. That was too easy for me too. What else do we have here? Just little use? Is that it? Anything else? No? Well, that was easy. Boop. It's me pressing the easy button. All right. Uh, what do we get from it? Max silver, serpent scales, Svartalheim steel. Good. What do we get here? Some health, some hack silver, a serpent scale, some hack silver, symbol of providence, whatever that is. And what else? Soft Spartalheim steel. What is the symbol of providence, I wonder? Let us find out. Symbol of providence. Defense, luck seven. <gasps> I use luck. I use luck a lot. Well, where do we want to put this? Ooh, not there. Not there. Luck 10, wait a minute. Oh, this has a socket. Hey, that works for me. Okay, let's put our symbol of providence in there. Yeah, a little bit of extra defense, a little bit of extra luck. Great, fantastic. All right, so we are gonna take that knife for reasons unknown as of yet, and we're gonna work our way out of this room. I still haven't found that my talisman has done anything useful for me yet. But, you know, who knows? Okay, so we've done everything that there is to do here. So this says we can just make our way downtown. How does someone out. train him like that? Kill his own father over some treasure? It seems so greedy. Remember what I told you, boy? Assume nothing. Well, sure. He didn't seem like a great father. No, well, thank you. Yeah. Are you gonna attack me? Do I get to just escape with my life intact? We are done here. Fantastic. Then I will do that. I have the fear, but I'm just going to walk away. Unattacked. And everyone's fine with that. Wait. Are there resources to be had from fighting him though? Will he fight me? We're gonna save the game. And then we're gonna find out. I have no idea what's about to happen, but we just saved the game. And I just want to see if there's like excellent <clears throat> resources to be had. I don't know if this is going to spell out my doom. It very well might. But I have to find out for myself. Up 
open it. Ouch. Again, gonna do a little punching. So hopefully, I can heal up a little bit. That is not an efficient way to heal up at all. Where's the thing to pick up? hit him! Oh, I'm so gonna die! Oh my god, I'm gonna die. I don't have a thing! I don't have a thing! Atreus, help! I totally hit him. Don't tell me there's two of them. I need another health. I need another health. I need a real bad. Oh, why don't I use that on that guy? What is that? Not do anything? Good. These are these guys. Running from the frost ancient. Hoping to find a little bit of health anywhere in the world. Please, if I kill this little yonder, hopefully he'll drop a health. He'll, dro he'll drop a health. He dropped a health. Okay, don't lose all the. That was like no health at all. Ah! Wolfle Hoss, do something. Okay. Running and running. I'm on fire. Running, 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 because I still, I literally have like one health. This is horrible. Gotta go pick up, doing a little flyby, pick up the thing. Running. Oh, that's it. Oh, I was so close. Well, there's no reason, right, for me to start over from my save because I didn't use any resources. I don't have a health stone. So there's no reason for me not to just go back out and try again. What if I just started out with something more powerful? Let's see if, I just, I found this doesn't do anything. Yeah, that, I mean, did actually a decent amount. Um, My shield works on that thing? Has my shield always worked on that thing? No way my shield has always worked on that thing. Why did that health stone not heal me? Why is that the second time that's happened? I don't know what to make of that. Fire! 
Joseph. <laughs> I feel like such an idiot. I promise you my shield has not always worked on a frost ancient beam. <laughs> why? Just why? Like, why? I have no words for how hard that was and then immediately how easy that was. I have no words for that. <laughs> I'm like angry now. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> wow. Wow. Cedar sigil of toughness. Resistance to poison. That's kind of helpful if you know what you're about to come up against. Ancient rubble. Serpent scale. Ancient's heart. I feel like that will be useful. All right. So it seems like resource wise, it was a good idea to fight the frost ancient. And just pure knowledge-wise, it was probably a really good idea to, to fight that Frost Ancient. Yeah, I feel better actually having punched that pile of logs. How was that so easy the second time? I'm like, I'm so mad at myself. Oh my gosh. <clears throat> I, I don't even know what else to say. I really don't. Like, for real? I don't know what to make of that. You uh, didn't happen to find that whetstone, perchance. Actually, I didn't. We found no whetstone. But the journey was the friends we made along the way. Took it. They took most of the good stuff. Oh? Well, here, take this. In exchange for the dagger. A talisman of betrayal. Activate, activate while aiming to slow me down quite time. quite interesting. An artless design, but the construction is sound. Where in the temple did you find this? In a river's back. Oh. Oh. He mentioned he was part of a larger clan. Maybe they took the whetstone? Quite possibly. I know I've seen this design before. I have a favor to ask. Just a small favor, really. Sure. You sure. remember the dagger you gave me? I the literally just the gave it to back. you. His own son killed him? Yeah. I haven't forgotten that one. Well, I traced it to a group of reavers that operate out of the Northry stronghold. I'd wager that's where they took their haul from Fafnir's storeroom. Along with that whetstone that I could use to help you. <laughs> could you? Very well. To business. Another treasure hunt? Pointless. Well, not if Sindri really can make us better equipment with that whetstone. Plus, the Reaver's son. He murdered his father. And that is our business because... Alright, so currently we have a, da a talisman that has 8 defense, 0 cooldown. We could switch it out for something that has 6 defense, 8 cooldown. Or more, um, well, yeah, I mean, or more if we upgraded it even more, but we can't put a enchantment into a blue talisman. So I think we're gonna stick with the gold one. We still don't have the pure essence of realms, but I think that's fine. I mean, we could sell these for some hack silver because we're never going to use them because they favor cooldown. So. Tidy up your knapsack. 
Thank you. I love a nice tidy knapsack. Enchantment wise, I'm not really ready to sell any of these, even though I'm sure I'm never gonna use this. Enchanted death, why not? I don't know. I don't wanna spend too much time on it. Um, we don't have any of those like artifacts, which is fine. We can only buy what we've already sold to him, which we have no interest in doing. We do want a resurrection stone though. We do owe ourselves that. So I still see that this purple one is like legendary compared to the superior resurrection stone. I just, I really do tend to prefer just getting a full bar of health rather than getting like a full bar of rage, but I understand the concept because rage does regen your health. I get it, we'll get the legendary stone, but it's just not my preference, you see. But it's fine. And we don't want any of those. What can we craft? I don't know what any of these resources are. Mist Echoes, Niflheim, Alloy, Invaldi's, Rusted Armor. I don't know what any of those are. And I don't know how to get them. I have a feeling they're linked to various things around the realm that we just have not the time to explore. Because we need to finish this game up. Summon a Maelstrom. Yeah, I don't know where you get smoldering enders at all. At all. So we're just gonna leave all of that there. Was there more to discuss? Um uh, no, I I don't believe there was. However, we do want to make sure that we are activating our quest. Retrieve the whetstone. We should check it out and see what we find. Let's do it. Can we get there faster by doing this? Let's find out. All of these side quests. Ah, there's so many of them. Bones, bones. Family business, okay. So where can we get to this? Uh, I don't know. I honestly don't think any of this will be much faster. So we're just gonna, we're gonna go there the old fashioned way. So we're on our way to get the whetstone <laughs> from the Reavers and it's gonna be great. <laughs> Yeah, 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 yeah. Everything is perfect. Everything is awesome. Just like the song. What is Mimir gonna say on this journey, I wonder? Nothing? This would be a great time for him to launch into a lore story. And he's gonna say, oh, there we go. Okay, 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 okay. Yes. And you brought it down to save me? It was very heroic. Did you expect anything less from Kratos? He's made it pretty clear that, you know, in his actions that he does care about you. He has made it very unclear with his words, but with his actions, he's been very Mayor, clear. Why did you work for Odin if he's so horrible? It's my career. And if you mean to make your career as a counselor to kings, you can't very well rule out petty maniacs. Available positions are scarce enough. My first master was a cruel piece of work as well, but I learned through him the enduring power of wit, which served me well with kings and gods alike. I couldn't have been much older than you when I started. A fairy king's errand boy and unofficial jester. By night, my mates and I had the run of the forest. Good fellows, they called us. Knavish sprites to the last. We'd get up to all manner of mischief, making fools of the local mortals. But as long as our lord was kept amused, we will spare the consequences. And we'll pick this up later. Hmm, a hidden area, you- oh. Well, if 
If I've learned one thing, it's that I have a shield. So let's just find out if that's gonna work again, why don't we? I like that actually quite a lot. I like that quite a lot. Actually, <laughs> I like that quite a lot. Um, um, <laughs> let's see. Oh my gosh, this shield totally works. No way. That was so easy. That all. <laughs> Oh my gosh, makes me so mad. <laughs> Fantastic. What do we got? Wait, that's the same thing. No, now we have two of them. I don't need two of them. What good is two sigils that I'll never use? Nothing. Oh my gosh. Boy, read this scroll. Look here. Yes, sir. I can't believe how easy that was. Hey, it's another treasure map. Another treasure map, huh? For one eternal frost? I wished to make a contribution to Fafnir's collection of relics. I arrived to find the door locked and Reavers blocking the way I came. I quickly buried my treasure and hid as fast as I could. If I manage to escape, I'll return to this spot. I'm gonna guess he did not escape, and I'm also gonna wonder... Who can guess what that accent was? Uh, nobody, because I made it up. Made no sense. What did I get? Hey, it's a fragment of a language. Oh, thing. that's. We should look for more like this. Exactly what I wanted. A language cipher. Hello. <laughs> and goodbye. Ha ha ha! All right. Well, this was a, actually, honestly, kind of a little fruitful little. Uh, stop that we just made excuse you the question is yeah like this is where we're going do we really have to keep do we have to what's the plan here do we go through here seems like maybe we do North Three Gorge. Okay. Let's see my first job. I, I know how to steer a boat. Me and my mates had the run of the forest. As long as we kept the fairy king amused. You know what? I'll tell this one later. Oh, please do, Mimir. Okay. Is this where we're supposed to be? Yeah. Seems like... Yes. Wait! The bones is exactly why I stopped there. Where where were the bones? What? I thought there were bones there. Look, I know that I said I would not get distracted. Hey. Oh. If I'm a god, god. Maybe I can fly. No, no! Gods too must stay on the path. I promise you. So Mamir. Seem like maybe you know Brock and Sindri. Or the Huldra brothers. Well, who doesn't? They're quite famous or infamous, depending on your point of view. They crafted Mjolnir, you see. Thor's hammer? The Aesir's greatest murder weapon, the bane of giant kind. They made Thor's hammer? I don't think they'd like this. Oh, I should say not. But this was long ago, and they were eager to make a name for themselves. Rather.
rather overdid it with that one, methinks. Let me in! Okay. That was on me. That was on me. I, it's just that I have to know if the bones were, he, like, right here. How do I track that? Nope, 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 nope. It's just because they were right there that makes me think, well, how did I miss them? What? Right, oh, in this little alcove. Okay, 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 okay. It's not so much that I care so much about finding the bones, these bones. but they were right what there, so her? I had to get them. To Govi? Your mother. What have you left unsaid? I... I guess... I just want to know if she's okay. She's Aww. dead, boy. I know that! I... You don't understand. Oh. Neither do you. There's... Oh, there's so much in that. That little conversation. Of Atreus seeing things from a, an extremely mortal perspective, almost from a religious perspective of, you know, she's dead, but her soul lives on, whether in whatever afterlife or through us. And I just want to know if she's okay. You know, I still feel connected to her, even if she's not with us anymore. And Kratos, in hearing... I just want to make sure she's okay is like well she's dead so obviously she's not okay she's dead that doesn't it doesn't get less okay than that but then in the same token kratos has been to the underworld i'm confused i always heard that Baldur's mother was frig aye frig well that's more of a pet name you see it means beloved something odin called freya after they wed out of affection at first, or so I like to believe. As things turned sour, it became a way to manipulate the truth. How so? Odin didn't want Freya, a Vanir goddess, getting credit for anything in Asgard. So anything worthy she accomplished was attributed to Frigg. Like That's right! Freya was Baldur's mother all along. Atreus is over it. All right, so we're back in Fafnir's storeroom. There was a slight detour to pick up some bones with a shockingly deep little side conversation that we what never would have something? engaged nothing. in. Nothing? There is nothing left to say. What about everything we've done so far? That man coming to the house? Talking to the world serpent? We've done so many amazing things. I just want to tell her about them. Don't you? What else would you say to her? I tell her that we're both okay. Not to worry about us. Atreus, I... I miss her too. You know this. I thought I knew very little. How do I kill this bird? From here, okay. It's so clear to me that the person who wrote that once you retrieve the whetstone the person who wrote that has lost someone they love it's so clear to me because there's so much truth in losing someone and feeling like you just have so much left to say because when you have a connection with somebody the kind of connection that you share your life with them, whether that's a, a family member of some kind or a very close friend or what have you. You want to tell them about the good things in your life and the bad things in your life. And that's your way of connection. Your life is shared. It's a shared thing. Your relationship holds those moments, those memories. And when the other person dies you lose a place where you used to hold something important to you. 
And so you still have this habit of wanting to fill that relationship. You have this connection that you want to bridge and you want to share more, but they're not there anymore. And you don't, you, you feel empty. You keep, it's like, it's like a severed connection. And that's something that you can, it's really hard to put into words. It's really hard to explain. And it's really hard to conceptualize, but once you've experienced it, which so many of us have, I mean, grief, losing someone you love, that is a universal human experience. Once you've really experienced it, like it doesn't even need to be explained. You're like, yes, there are things I wish I could still say. There are things I wish I could share with this person. I would want them to have been there for this moment. And they're not. And that's sad. So it's, it's, it's <laughs> very intense. Very, very intense. Please take utmost care while handling it. It is a priceless relic after all. Wow, we're almost halfway done killing the ravens. All in this one stream. I mean, honestly, like we're 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 doing it. Why? Is that a piece of my braided mistletoe arrow adorning your quiver strap? Oh, are we uh, finally bringing that back a up? Memento of your good pal Sindri. Raya told us to get rid of those because they were like toxic or something. Okay, I've been waiting to see how that comes back into the game. And you just brought it back up like it was no big deal. So to work we go. I actually don't think I need anything from you. So Or never mind then. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> back to your business. Uh what am I doing here? Where am I going? definitely crushing that for no reason except to smash um okay boop, 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 boop. we need to reactivate our correct maybe we should finish the bones quest if it's gonna have that sort of like emotional catharsis maybe we should finish the bones quest either way i oh this was just a little pit stop Oh, we're back in the boat then. Carrying on. I still can't believe the son would kill his own father. That's crazy, right? Good, Atreus. It's good that you can't believe he would do that. I got one side of the story. But come on, his own father? I mean, I get angry at you sometimes. But do you? Oh. I mean, Sometimes, yeah. Okay, this is Pirates of the Caribbean ride right at Disneyland. Back. No. This I this little not. cavern right here. Totally pirates. Sorry, I was very distracted by that. But it's a good thing that Atreus would never stab Kratos in the back. Atreus, he is a moody, angry teenage boy. This clan really but he is good boy. Coming in. How are we supposed to get through? There must be a way to lift the gate. There must be a way to lift the gate. Maybe with the big water wheel. Maybe My thought as well. it should not be a puzzle. Maybe we should spell it right out for that for the player and we should not let them have even a second to guess. Sounds about right. Well, you, sir, look like yeah, you. Yeah. Atreus. I'm not ready. You don't know this stream chat viewers. <laughs> stream or chat or viewers. You don't know this, but I was pressing square like aggressively while that <laughs> attack came down on me. And I was like, hello, you're supposed to be stunned. That's why I didn't dodge that. Okay. So I'm not a bad gamer. Um, Atreus was a little behind. Okay. So yeah, it's definitely not me. Yeah, not me. Okay. You're going to blow up when you die. That's fun for me. Another one bites dust. I'm gonna try one of these. Oh, you are already dead. Okay. Atreus, don't stand there, they blow up. Where are 
are you? Okay. I'm just gonna do one of these, and then I'm gonna do one of these. Oh, I forgot I have this. Oh, wow. That's just... That's just... I'm sorry. How is that attack so powerful? Like, look at this. This is only supposed to be four damage and five frost. That's that's not supposed to be that powerful. The other ones that are... Oh, well, I guess the other ones don't have that many. This is my most upgraded one. This one does not do that much damage. I guess it makes sense. But honestly, like, it should not be that powerful, in my opinion. I mean, like, I'm not complaining. <laughs> I like that it's powerful. I like that this game just got a lot easier for me. Trust me. But... Um, I should have had that a long time ago. So, this is a broken water wheel. But broken in a way that allows me to get across. So, I'll take it. What is all this, huh? Witchcraft? Smash it all. Yeah, try to do your witchcraft now. Yeah. Anyways. Moving on. <laughs> Good, good, good. We're gonna pause you. Good, good, good. And we're gonna take whatever is in here. Yes, we will. Smash. What do we got? Hack silver. Well, that's not as impressive as I was hoping at all. Okay, so back up here. Atreus, clear the area. So we need to get this. Moving! No problem. Easy peasy. Okay, you do that. And while you're doing that... Wolfelhost. Ah, but on the right person! Atreus, over here! Bring your Wolfelhost over here! Oh my god, what are you focusing on the wrong person for? Ay, ay, ay. Really sucks to be one of those guys. They just, they just get obliterated. Real unfortunate. You know, if I was, you know, having to pick who I wanted to be in this game, it would, it would still be Kratos. Now, for some reason, I feel like this is going to impale me if I don't choose carefully when to jump. Why do I feel that way? Okay. Well, that didn't get me access to you at all. But access to you is what I want. Well, that also didn't give me access to you. Question is, how do I get access to you? It's not through there. And it's not through here, but it might be through there. Hey, come look at this. Yes. Is there something in particular you're telling me to look at? Or are you just daydreaming? Okay. Thank you, Atreus. Ah, I see. Obviously, this is just hack silver, but you know. Now! Okay, great. I don't know how to get to you, but it seems like there are these little runes up here. HX. T? I don't know. So, I don't know. Maybe I just haven't activated you yet. Somehow. Something. 
something. Somehow, something, something. That's about as eloquent as I am going to get with that. And that's okay. All right. Oh, climbing. Could climb. But why? Could take the boat. Or could climb. Okay, let's try the climbing. I don't know where it's going to take me. But, you know, sometimes you got to do things even when you don't know what the outcome might be. That's called adventuring. Aha! What did I get? Axel. You know. Could, could, could be better. Could be worse. Nope, nope, nope. Nope, 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 nope. Okay. I don't know how to get that chest and it's really bothering me. But for now, we'll just do this. When are you angry? What? With me. When? Oh, I guess sometimes when you don't think I can do something, but I can. It is not always easy to know what. It's okay. I get it. I'm little. Where's that whetstone, I wonder? It's so nice that Atreus isn't being like moody, angry teenager because, oh, that was just a bad time. Okay, I totally dodged that. is just fantastic. Okay. I really dig that quite a bit. All right, what did I get here? Symbol of determination, hmm? What am I determined to do, hmm? What else did I get? Symbol of concentration, determination and concentration. Well, I'm gonna have to see what those are about. Let's see. Symbol of determination. Okay, we have runic defense, runic and defense, meh. Runic and cooldown, also meh. Useless. And that's gonna be all for today's playthrough of God of War. Short, simple, sweet, what more could you want? More goofs, more silliness? Is that what you want? <laughs> Okay, I guess I have to oblige. You definitely wanna make sure you're stay tuned for the next episode then. I hope you all enjoyed this playthrough. Please remember to like the video if you did enjoy this playthrough and please remember to share it with all your friends so they can enjoy it too. And if that means sharing it to Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, whatever that may be, trust me, it helps. I promise you that. If you even wanna share it to your YouTube community tab, that helps as well. Thank you all so much for helping my channel grow just as much as as I could even possibly hope for. I appreciate y'all so much. And please remember to subscribe to this little channel right here if you do wanna stick around and watch more videos, which I hope you do. And that's all. I love you all. <laughs>